Hi everyone. This week we will have a word, a word that we will focus on each day and connect to new words as we learn new things. This week's focus word is weather. Listen to me say that one more time. Weather. Now it's your turn. I want to hear you say the word. Nice word. Now let's clap out the syllables in the word. The word weather has two syllables. Weather. Now let's do that together. Weather. Nice work. Hmm. What is the first sound that we hear in weather? Weather. That's right. And what letter makes that w sound? That's right. It's W. W makes the w sound just like in weather. This is a circle map. Creating circle maps for our words will help us learn more about our words. It will make learning new words easy and fun. Our focus word goes in the center and our focus word is weather. What do you know about weather? Draw or write in the big circle. Um, let's start off with, how do we say weather in Spanish? In Spanish, we say el tiempo or la clima. And can you help me in Chinese? That's right, friends, we say xian shi. And what else do we know about the weather? We could say, hmm, sometimes the weather is cold. What else do we know about the weather? Well, how about we get to our article a day and we'll find out more information to put into our circle map. This week, we will learn all about the different kinds of weather and how we can watch to see what the weather will be like. Today, we will read an article titled, The Story of a Snowflake. Snowflakes fall from the clouds to the ground. Hmm. How do we say to fall down in Spanish? Can you help me? That's right. In Spanish, we say caerse. And in Chinese, we say, Dao Tia. Can you use your hands to show snowflakes as they fall down from the clouds? Right, just like this. Yeah. So let's get to our article. Let's start by looking at this picture. What do you see? I see snowflakes falling down from the cloud to the ground. Remember friends, I will read this article two times. So listen carefully because afterwards we will take out our book of knowledge and write or draw one thing we have learned to share with our class. So let's start at the top of the page. Do you know how we get snowflakes? 
Let's find out. First, drops of water in clouds get cold. Next, those drops turn into bits of ice. Then the bits of ice stick together in different shapes. They fall from the clouds to the ground. We call these icy shapes, snowflakes. All right, let's read that one more time. Do you know how we get snowflakes? Let's find out. First, drops of water in clouds get cold. Next, those drops turn into bits of ice. Then the bits of ice stick together in different shapes. They fall from the clouds to the ground. We call these icy shapes snowflakes. All right, friends, now it's time to take out our book of knowledge. You can grab your notebooks or a piece of paper and something to write with. I will take out our class book of knowledge and we will write or draw one thing you learned to share with our class. Let's go to week two watching the weather day one the task is to draw or write one thing you learned about snowflakes remember friends we can always go back to our word bank to help us spell any new words that we have learned such as clouds fall snowflakes so what did we learn about snowflakes? Hmm, so what is something that we learned from the article? I know, I learned that snowflakes are droplets of water in a cloud that stick together to form snowflakes. And the snowflakes, they fall down from the clouds to the ground. I'm gonna draw plenty of snowflakes. And when I'm done with my drawing, it's time for me to label my picture. So this is a picture of a cloud how do we spell cloud check your word banks what's that first sound we hear k. that's right that k sound is made with the letter c cloud that next letter u l o u and that last sound d. that's right it's the letter d so we have one cloud and here we have snowflakes. And how do we spell snowflakes? It's in your word bank. Snow, S N O W, flakes. That's right. F L A K E N S, because there's more than one. So once I'm done with my drawing and labeling the different parts of my picture, it's time for me to write my sentence. What can I say? I know, snowflakes fall from clouds, right? Snowflakes fall, and how do we spell fall? What's that first sound we hear? F, 
That's right, A, L, and a bonus L. Snowflakes fall from clouds. All right, can you guys help me read my sentence? Snowflakes fall from clouds. All right, nice work. Now it's your turn. I can't wait to see your drawings. <laughs> 